All right, let's start with number one. So it says an amount is invested for five years at 10% per annum, compound interest. The final amount is 9,000. Calculate the starting amount. So we can use a compound interest formula where the final amount, which is A, has been given to us as 9,000 Rand, but they haven't given us the starting amount. So we'll just leave it as P. The interest rate is 10%, which is 0 0.1, and the number of years is five. So all you do now to get P by itself, because in between the P and the bracket is a times, so all that you do is you do this. You divide the left-hand side by the 1 plus 0 0.1 to the power of 5, and you type all of that in the calculator just like that, and what you'll find is a P value of 5588.29. And moving on to number two, Amy would like to have 10,000 Rand in five years. The bank offers her an interest rate of 12% compound. How much must she invest now so that she will have 10,000 Rand? So we know that Amy would like to have 10,000 Rand, so that's the final amount. We don't know how much she's going to start off with, so we'll just leave it as P. The interest rate is 12% or 0 0.12, and it's also going to be a five-year period. What you then do is to get the P by itself, you divide the 10,000 by the whole bracket with the little exponent of 5. Type that all in on the calculator and you would get a final answer of 5,674 Rand and 27 cents.